but yeah, I'm going to run inside the nail shop. Ooh, ow! <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to another day of Vlogmas. I hope you guys are doing fabulous today. Big up, big up, big up. I am drinking a cup of tea. I just made a cup of tea and it is 10.27? Basically 10.30. Well, I've been up, but I just decided that I'm going to go down to the gym, do a little cardio, and then I'm going to come back up and start my day. So I have a session today. I have a therapy session today which I'm going to do and then we can start the day. So I just want to say something to you guys before we start. So a lot of you have been messaging me and leaving comments and basically saying that I am not coming out and talking to you guys and telling you what's going on behind the scenes and I just want to say briefly to you that a lot is going on. I don't know if it is evident or not a lot is going on and especially no i'm going to be vlogging every single day i don't know how i'm going to cope with that but a lot is going on and right now is not the time that i am able to just come and just lay it all out and just say everything there is a lot that I am figuring out and please remember that I am an immigrant here. I am an immigrant in this country. I'm not familiar with a lot of things and a lot of things I just have to figure out and I really don't know what my life is going to look like tomorrow, next month, next week, next year. I really don't know. So I have a lot that I have to be working on. And remember too, like my core support system is not here. I can't go next door to go vent. I can't even take a drive and go vent. You know, I don't have that, my core support system here. So I'm just, I'm dealing with a lot, all right? And I'm not trying to be fake as a few of you have put it. I'm just trying to balance everything while still showing up on camera which is a very difficult very difficult it's not easy to come and talk to you guys and you know even when prior to talking to you I, i'm going through it after i talk to you i have to be going through it and dealing with my real life situation it's very very difficult but i'm trying and no it's not the time that i want to just pour it all out because it's a lot and it's a lot that I need to figure out so I can know how to navigate my future and my daily life overall. Two things I really want to work on is my physical health and my mental health because my brain is bursting and I'm trying to keep the lid on it. So that's the reason too I've decided to start you know, therapy and to get help to process my feelings and my thoughts to kind of group them together to kind of understand them and to also kind of navigate them and it helps too to have somebody that is paid to listen to you to listen to your problems right and also to have a professional that can deconstruct uh your issues or your emotions and kind of steer you in the right direction so that's what I'm kind of dealing with right now. So again, I appreciate your support and all of that, but right now the internet is not the place where I need to come and cry and pour it all out. It's just not the place. I have been though pouring it all out on random strangers. Like that is where I'm at. I've been pouring it out on strangers. <laughs> well, yeah, I say I call them strangers because they're people that I've never seen a day in my life, but I have to be pouring it out on them because I have nowhere else to turn. So if you're new over here, welcome to my channel. I'm Alicia Kim. I know if this is your first encounter with me, you're probably like, what is going on, right? But 
please watch some older vlogs and get caught up so we can get more familiar with each other. And to my big up crew, go on, do the do, you know, my love you already, right? So yeah, let me get on with what I need to deal with now and then we can hang out later on in the day. Okay guys, let's officially get this vlog started and today we're getting in the Christmas mood, the Christmas spirit. So number one on the list is to wear red number two dose is to pick up christmas drinks i love getting christmas drinks every single year it's like tradition for me whether it's dunkin or starbucks i love the christmas drinks i always do that so i am going to head over to starbucks now and pick up something let me just look on their instagram to see what they have so they have hot cocoa peppermint caramel sugar cookie chestnut i always get the peppermint oh i think what i'm going to do is ask whoever is at the window to make me their favorite christmas drink from the menu that's what i'm going to do then number three on the list to get in the christmas spirit you always need to be listening to christmas music the songs and for me my favorite song of all time my favorite christmas song apart from jingle bell <laughs> is all i want for christmas by the one and only mariah carey so i'm going to play my christmas playlist i think i heard that song the first time in love actually that movie that christmas movie love actually i think that's the first time i heard that song and i fell in love with it and i don't care about the presents or they need that christmas tree <laughs> hi uh could you do you have a favorite holiday drink right now for yourself <laughs> i think the my favorite sugar cookie on my latte sugar cook almond we come to pop and okay so may i have a grande cold please your favorite just the way you, you like it sugar cookie yeah i, I like with one extra shot oh you like an extra shot okay all Can right yeah sure Okay. okay guys so she's going to make me her favorite on the menu which is a sugar cookie so let's see Sorry, I'm confused. okay okay thank you thank you <laughs> let me just park up and give it a taste so she gave me a grande ice sugar, sugar cookie almond milk, light ice, blonde espresso, and it says triple. I don't know what that means. I do not understand Starbucks jargon, but let's taste this and see if it's going to get us in the Christmas spirit. I usually always just go for the peppermint, but she recommended this and it has little sprinkles on top, red and green sprinkles. It's okay, but it's not giving me Christmas. Mm -mm. It's not giving me Christmas. It's giving me coffee, but not Christmas. Yeah. Anyway, guys, number four on the list is we need to correct this. What is this color? What is this? Mm -mm. Can't work. So every December, I love to get Christmas themed nails, and usually that. It's always red getting that red polish immediately put me in the christmas mood so let's head to all right every time i okay we're good to go yeah i'm going to head to the nail shop and change this color i don't like this drink at all i think it's because she she may be a coffee drinker i am not i am a matcha girl matcha girl green tea girl i am not a triple shot of espresso kind of girl but yeah i'm going to run inside the nail shop Ooh, ow <laughs> i'm going to run inside this nail shop hopefully they can take me because i did not make an appointment Anyway, let's run inside.
you guys nails check so i had her cut it down really really short so they are much shorter than they were before but i love the color it's given christmas so definitely in the christmas spirit right now it is 5 16 so it's about to get dark and i'm still drinking my drink the next thing on the list to get in the christmas mood is to go somewhere where there is a lot of christmas decor decoration you can get inspired so if it's even to window shop i need some little you know those little small christmas trees that i can put on my kitchen counter i think i need two of those to add some greenery to the kitchen because you saw what i did yesterday which wasn't much so if i can get some little small little christmas trees to put if it's even two to add some greenery to the kitchen that would be really good so let's head over to hobby lobby <laughs> towel and it says a merry right i was hoping they had something like a white one that would say christmas but it's only merry but i was thinking i could put these two together like this possibly i mean they have these two merry christmas merry christmas but not have fun those Have yourself a merry little Christmas. When I just came in Hobby Lobby in October, all of this section filled with ornaments. Today, not even a single ornament. I'm going to ask them, where are their ornaments? Because I can't. I can't believe everything is sold out. Guys, I'm inside Home Goods, and one thing I can tell you about people in America. They do not play about shopping. Why is Home Goods empty? Why Hobby Lobby is so out of ornaments? On the second day of Christmas, my true love came to me. Guys, I'm back home and i got a few things i really wanted to get something for the bathroom to put some vibes in the bathroom so i have two options and i'll show you i got this from home goods which is a nice arrangement so i got this and then i got these hand towels the little snowman so cute and then the red trim really nice i also got this candle as well so we're going to put this in the bathroom this is a candle so we're going to put, ooh, we're going to put those in the bathroom and bring a little christmas in there in hobby lobby now i got the little Christmas trees that I was telling you about and they add the I got this one and I got a smaller one so I got two can I tell you how the store is empty Americans do not play when it comes to shopping listen anyway and then kitchen towel wise these are the best that I could come up with so I'm hanging on to these for now um, was that all oh I wasn't sure in Happy Lobby I picked out these stems so I don't know I was thinking these for the bathroom but then it just looks so bare you know look very bare so let's go in the bathroom and kind of place these <laughs> Thank you. 
so guys that's my day of getting in the christmas mood i had stopped and ordered some jamaican food i ordered jerk chicken with curry gravy on the set what kind of gravy i asked for jerk chicken with curry gravy on the side extra gravy this is curry right that's curry what is this some farmer brown stew gravy uh so jerk chicken fried plantain a little salad and rice and the peas this will be my first meal for the day it bad but i'm about to tear this up <laughs> mash this down so yeah i love how the bathroom looks it's slowly but surely every room is going to be looking a lot like christmas tomorrow the coach should be delivered hopefully so i may be able to put up the tree tomorrow um hopefully if not it's sometime this week though i hope you guys enjoyed the vlog i do feel like i'm getting into the christmas schmood i do feel better now than i felt when i woke up this morning so i'm happy for that hope you guys enjoyed the vlog remember just go on and do 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 Leave a like on the video if you're not already subscribed. Please go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I love you guys and I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys.